Okay, looks like they're attacking each other. As long as he just keeps fighting them, as long as he loses, that's good for us. That's all we want, really. But yeah. Okay. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm I'm just gonna go for, I'm just gonna go feed him, because I just feel like that's the thing to do. He just wants food. He's literally just trying to eat my hands. But yeah. And I'm back. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I really, I really do apologize for that. He's never done that before. He's almost always been completely quiet. Really weird. But there we go. We're back. Okay. I can send for Faceless Man, but I feel like we're going to kill him anyway. I really don't see the point in getting a Faceless Man. As long as he's fighting the others, he's kind of always losing men. So as long as he's kind of concentrating on them, and they do have more men as well, we should be fine. Then we can just kill him. How many men does he have at the moment? 5,000. Okay, see, there we, there we go. He's getting less and less men. And his enemies... Ramsey at 73% against them. So there we go. He might defeat them. Ramsey the Hunter. I guess Ramsey the Hunter does kind of suit him. He does like to hunt. So it does make sense. Um, but yeah. Apparently someone said he can... Stannis apparently says he can burn my dog for me. Thank you, Stannis. <laughs> I'm guessing you're up north. You're probably on the wall still. Let's have a quick look. Oh, where is Shireen? Where'd Shireen go? Let's have a look at the history. Okay, Shireen, she lost Dragonstone. Okay, but she's at Storm's End. And let's have a look at her father then. Yep, he's still on the wall. Oh, his wife, though, is dead. Died in the dungeons of Lord Paramount Tolman. Wow, okay. But yeah. Okay. Daenerys is still at war with Mace. We still cannot see the score at the moment. But yeah. What is this? Has he declared war? Still, Jon has not declared the war for Dawn yet against the White Walkers. And we have King Tormen Giants Bane. Apparently he's declared himself king. But yeah. But yeah, we just need to wait and see. That's literally all we can do right now. It's been a ridiculous war. I think we'll probably have to continue the stream next week and see what happens. Okay, there we go. He's fighting more then, and he's doing a river crossing. So he should he's, ah, he's not going to lose any men, really, is he? We're just going to have to kill him. I'm gonna, we're going to take our men down, get out of here for now. I think we're just going to get out of there and just try and kill him. That's literally the only thing. He's defeating the other rebellion. They don't seem to have like any men from what I can see. Probably because I killed some of them, which was kind of dumb. But yeah. 191. Come on, guys. 191. Uh, Indoril said, notice me, NG. I've noticed you. Hello. Nice to have you here. Um, but yeah. Apparently, Edward's in a fight. He says, make me. Not sure what the hell is going on here. Okay. Yeah, so now he's come down. This is a good job we moved then. Good job we moved out of there. But we, we don't want to go too far. Let's just stay here for now. Let's just, no, let's just stay in the neck for now. The neck's fine. How's the neck doing? Howland is still alive. Howland Reed. Um, obviously, Joe John is dead. Poor, poor Joe John. Mira has not come back, but she did get married. She's actually in the Blackwoods. Okay. So apparently she's. Okay, she's uh, not at court. A regent rules in her name, even though she does not need a regent. I have no idea. Apparently we need a new maester, which I did not notice. Let's go send for a maester. Excellent. But yeah. Uh, must be hard having a dog in China. Everyone's probably trying to eat him. Actually, that never happens. Most people are trying to not eat dogs. That's kind of a, an old thing. <laughs> um, people don't... It's more of a, I think it's more of a Vietnamese thing, from what I can tell. Ooh, Jenna Lannister. We could probably push for Jenna Lannister and her, you know, ex-husband was murdered on the orders. Yep, obviously of uh, Carhold. Ah, poor, poor times. So, which son? None of these sons inherited. Oh, yeah, it was Tywin. Yes, it was. His father was Cleosfrey. I always liked Cleosfrey. Obviously, if you watch the TV shows, Cleosfrey does not last very long. But uh, in the books, I really like Cleosfrey. He's one of my, uh, he's one of my favorite characters, actually. 
Not obviously a happy story, but still, I always liked the character. They're only at minus 13%. Word has come from the north, from Castle Black. Lord Commander Jon Snow writes that the cold winds are rising, the dead are walking, and the trees have eyes once again. Should we wa ride north to help the new this Lord, young Lord Commander, or should we just... He can deal with snarks and grumpkins. What does my small council think? My small council, come, what should we do here? What should we do? <laughs> should we help Jon Snow in the fight the White Walkers, be a hero of the War for Dawn? Or should we just let him deal with it himself? Just let him deal with himself, maybe. What does my small council think? Cleos was in the show, uh, Henry. Cleos is the Lannister that Jaime kills when he's in the cell so that he can try to escape. He has that one conversation, basically. That's it. <laughs> so he doesn't really last long. But yeah. Maybe he wasn't Cleos, but he definitely was a Frey. I know he was one of them. So I think he was basically there to replace Cleos Frey, basically. Um, so people are saying don't. Someone says yes. Um, ignore it and it will go away. Gather your strength and fight another day. Leave John to handle it. Jon Snow. The bastard. Eddard's bastard. Uh, someone said Ryden or someone said... It's kind of split them out. Everyone's kind of split. Hmm. I kind of like the idea of, you know, Peter being the hero of the dawn. But it kind of doesn't make sense right now because we're in our wars. Ramsay wears plot armor and his 20 good men are his bodyguards. Yes, it's why we can't kill him. Okay, so this is kind of split. Okay, since it's kind of split, I'm going to say we shouldn't do it just because I think, I think roleplay-wise, Peter wouldn't do it. And also at the moment, we probably shouldn't do it anyway. So I'm going to go for that. I think it would be fun to do it just because it's kind of a cool idea, but maybe it's not the right timing. Let's let him handle it then. The war between the great powers are over. And there we go, we've got, oh, the, the neck is now under us. We have our lands back, people. We have them. Now we can get all our men. <laughs> and actually, we don't, we only have these men, so we might as well just delete them, and then we can call upon all our men. So there we go, we have about 8,000 men we can call upon. That's it, people, we have it. This war is ours. And so I'm assuming she defeated Mace. Mace Tyrell was defeated, but he's not in jail, it looks like. Maybe she, maybe she decided to be lenient with him. But that's good for us. Obviously, the Greyjoys are still independent. Euron is still alive, the Crow's Eye. He uh, has a son who is the heir, Prince Quellon, who is an, a bastard, apparently. Legitimized, though. A legitimized bastard. Okay. Someone said imprison Ham... Why would I imprison Howland Reed? He's a good man, a good man. But yeah. Okay, let's call upon all our men. We ride north, people. Sadly, we didn't get these two, which is kind of dumb. We'll have to try and take those back at some point. Okay, I need to get these guys. There we go. Perfect. Everyone ride north. Ride north as quick as possible. So finally, Danny has actually done something good for us. But we just, we need to defeat these guys. Look at this. The AI has done so much, and we're still up north fighting for Sansa. <laughs> This has definitely not gone how I planned at all. But that's the, that's the lovely thing about this mod. It would be sad if it was always the same. You kind of want it to be different sometimes. Uh, a Walder Frey will be uh, Lord Walder the Late Lord. He's still bloody alive at 98 years old. How is that possible? How is that bloody possible? He is our Castellian right now. Let's pause it then and let's look for our council. I should probably put good men in charge. Now, Butterwell looks fine for that position. Just to see. Um... Okay, him, we'll, we'll put the Frey, Tyron Frey, we'll put him as that for now. Master at Arms should go to Miles Mutin. Congratulations on your promotion. Um, this guy's the best. Spy Master, he does not like us, so I don't want to make it him. So we'll keep the guy it is for now, because we can trust him. That's what we really want. And all the other guys are leader men, so we can't get them to do stuff for now. But here we go, we have enough men now to defeat Ramsey. Finally, something's gone our way, people. Finally. I still can't believe we had an imbecile daughter of all the ridiculous things. And I still can't seduce her. Why can't I seduce her? We have seduction focus. How can I not seduce her? Why is this? Can I seduce someone else? Obviously not her, but why can't I? Why can't I seduce San... Why can't I seduce Sansa? God damn it. Uh, Bradley would like to be my spy master. 
Ah, I'm so I'm sorry, my good sir. I cannot make you my spy master. For reasons, reasons. But yeah, who's helping John then in the north? So it looks as though last tough and Ramsey, Ramsey has joined. And he's got more men to support him. Damn him, because of the war. Yes, but it's only six thousand men, so that should put me in better stead. And he should be helping to fight the White Walkers. Damn you, Ramsey. He's trying to be a good. He's trying to be the hero. You can't be the hero. I'm meant to be the hero. And it looks so. Oh, Donald. Okay, looks like uh, Roos had a one baby before he died. But still good to kill him, just to get him out of the way. But we should be fine now. This war should be ours. She's your wife, NG. You're already sleeping with her. But you can usually seduce your wife just to make her like fall in love with you. I remember doing that with Daenerys in a past one. Okay, we have enough men here now. So let's just get these men going. If my damn mouse would bloody work. It's completely unprofessional right now. Dogs. Stupid mouses. Not so good, but yeah. You would like to be my regent. An absurd proposition. We'll make Sansa our regent. Yeah, we'll make Sansa. Sansa would not trick us, would you, Sansa? Would you? Designated regent. I probably need a bodyguard as well. Probably we should make Lofa Brun it. Where's Lofa Brun? Where is Lofa Brun? What the? What happened to Lofa? Did Lofa Brun die? No! Lofa Brun! No! Peter's leading the men at the moment. Yes, we should probably deal with that. Let's put the best men in charge. Miles Mouton. Howland Reed, of course. He'll help us. And Shadrick. Shadrick has been a good man for us. You good at fighting? 7.5. Yeah, yeah, you're not so good at fighting. We'll leave you. We'll put these men there into Moat Kalen. They can go capture Moat Kalen for now. There's 5,400 Bolton men up here. Maybe we should just go to attack them. They are in the plains right now. Are there any rivers? There's rivers everywhere, but not a drop to drink. How about we just go north then? How about we take this back? Or we could just take Ramsey. Ramsey, no, Ramsey's leading his men. He's in Dawn Forest. We need to get the Dawn Forest. How about we move the men here the King's Course? We'll just go there. Maybe he'll come to attack us. Then we can jump in. Apparently the Queen of Fawns is upset that I have not sang in this stream at all. I do apologize. I, I can't sing. It, I'm, I'm not a good singer. I don't like to sing. <laughs> I don't want to hurt people's ears and my own ears and embarrass myself, really. I've embarrassed myself enough so far with this damn dog. Stupid dog. He just sat under me now. Intervene on behalf of an aggression of another vassal. Okay, we'll hold him to stand down. Now, we're coming this way. Um, my cause is just. You have no right. Uh, maybe I'll allow it. I, I like this guy as well. Yeah, you know, maybe we'll allow it. You know, Peter doesn't really care. We'll, we'll allow it. There we go. Tyron Frey, we want you to like me. So we'll, we'll, we'll allow this to happen. Just this one just this one time. Rally men to battle against Joshua's evil. <laughs> okay, again, I'm just going to ignore the, the comments for now. <laughs> I'm going to ignore them for now. We should probably try to get here then. Try and help our fellow manly men. We gotta get there in time. 2,000 men down here. Maybe we could use these 2,000 men to kind of convince them to come to attack us. Now, we need different men to lead these ones. We'll have Sir Oswell Kettleback. Actually, is he a good fighter? No, not really. Titus Blackwood. And I guess we'll go for Tristan Ryger. There we go. And you come this way. You go that way. Okay. Now... His men are over here in Overton. Where are the rivers? Is there one from here, Widow's Watch? There is. There's basically, yeah, it looks like there's one from every angle. So we're not going to be able to attack them from there. Hmm. But we need to destroy this army at some point or we cannot capture Roos Bolton. That's the only thing. We have to defeat them in some way. And they're going the Hornwood. So that might be more easier. Is there one from here, the Hornwood? There is not. Okay, let's go up here then. Go to Dawn Forest. Hopefully we can try and outmaneuver them. We have more men here. We have 2,000 men coming to help. They should be able to deal with these Ramsey men. Ramsey said he could do it with 20 good men. We'll defeat him when he has 5,000. But my co-conspirator says that she has a good opportunity here. Excellent. 
So if we can kill him anyway, that'd be excellent. So he's chasing them at the moment. He's going to Efren. We'll get there on the 2nd of March, okay. So he'll get there on the 8th of March. How about we say we're going to go up here? Maybe that'll stop him. It will not stop him from moving up there. They have hills, but by the time we get there, he'll probably kill them. Yeah, he would have killed them by the time we get there. Doesn't seem much point in going up there then. Yeah, because he'll just have the advantage in that situation. Okay, I'm just going to go here then. We'll take this back. Yeah, by the time... Yeah, failure. Apparently his plot armor is saving him. Damn you, Ramsey. We can't kill him at all. It's impossible. His plot armor is too strong. It's over 9,000. We can't do this. But yeah, okay, we'll move these men in here. Just got to try and... Okay, he's coming back to Hornwood. 22nd of March. Okay, we should get there first. That should be fine for us. Okay, excellent. My co-conspirator has done it again. So, 6th of April. So, either way, we should be getting him here. Come on. Come on, be stupid, Ramsey. Attack me. Attack me! Stop trying to hit me and hit me! God damn you! Okay, he's almost there. 6th. There we go. Okay, so we have the advantage of the forest. So, we should do it. A few more men. These guys should be able to get here soon. Just one more day. There we go. Now, join in. We should have this. This should be it. Ramsey, you will face the wrath of Littlefinger. You will face my Littlefinger. And apparently we killed him. <laughs> so apparently we killed him. But that does now mean Lord Paramount Donnell is now the Lord Paramount. He is the last Bolton. And it means that he should be in Winterfell. So we can just go capture him in Winterfell. That's nice. Okay, there's no point killing him now. We need to win this war. So we'll just go defeat his armies. Fighting across the field, you see an enemy soldier. Charge. As you get close, you realize the enemy soldier is Lord Hugo himself. Before you can close ranks, though, Alassane leaps in your path. Get ready. Ooh, we do not want to fight her. Six. I actually have a higher dual skill, but, uh, yeah, we're not going to get involved in that. We've gained Craven. Yeah, Littlefinger's not going to fight them. Not, not when we're about to win. Littlefinger would never risk that sort of situation to be in a... He knows what happens last time we've met people in combat. He knows what happens in that situation. Um, this has 5,000 men defending, so we're going to need more men to defend. We'll send these guys up there to take that. These guys will take back this. There we go. This war should be won now. Excellent. Good, good, good. We finally won the North. That took so long. Yep, his men are destroyed. How, how are things going for you, John? That is not looking so good. The White Walkers are destroying you. Who controls this? Denny's Malister controls this, but he is now incapable. And Cotter Pike is still alive as well. So they're both still alive. I do not have bodyguards. I do need to go a bodyguard. I just didn't find any I liked. 